Hi, I'm Blue Samu, and we're. Sorry, women and that girl. That was a very sweet girl. Sorry. Three of you, which is a grab group. Grab. My name is Blue Sam. We're here in the studio of the 77, which is their rehearsal room. The 77 is a rap group in Brussels that I met when I started making music as well through a friend of mine. When they showed me their studio after some time, I decided to move in with them and make this my temple too. Cuz I'm a geek, play Tetris or repeat there in the week, belly any sleep, my eyelids fall down slowly, vision gets blurry. I'm so sorry for the worry and the hurry. Wish it didn't. Sam was I think a lot of things because it really depends on who I'm working with. So I don't make my instrumentals, I only write. I um, I don't sample, I don't know how to produce, sadly, not yet. <laughs> it's on the way. But uh, it's it really, it depends. I like to explore other people's vibes. I like to grow by actually doing different things. So um, I don't have like one certain person I would work with for forever. It's always gonna be someone different. I think that the reasons, depending on why I work with someone, is if I feel their vibe or not, and if I feel there's someone, something I can I can learn from. I'll never work with someone if it doesn't click. And you can be completely different than me and have a, a very structured way of working. That doesn't mean it won't click. Uh, it still might, because I like to learn from things like that. Of course, it's different to um, to make a song with someone than to perform it. When we're in the studio, we're just working off of vibes and it's it's incredibly fun and challenging because you get to really try things out in the studio. As when um, I go on a stage and I perform it with a DJ, it's, it's different because it's not with the producer who I made it with, it's really just me and my DJ and we're out there in front of a crowd trying to make y'all happy. I wouldn't have the one without the other, you know. I can give a good example. I, I had a performance yesterday at Reciclar. It was Spoiler Room Volume 4. It was ladies only and the vibe that you get from being on a stage with all of the people that receive your music in a positive way is just, is beautiful. And um, I, I really love doing that. Are you scared to walk alone or coming up contigo? No, you could stand on your own as a man with me. That means I believe when you do. I kill for my crew if they ever come knocking this blue some more. Hello, hello, how do you do? You better not come in here, people. Cabo contigo, standing up for me. So I guess you can say that um, now I have a half hour, so I have enough to do a whole set, which is nice because then um, I still get to perform while looking for newer songs to make and while searching for what I really want to put out there. And I guess I do that through my collabs and by working with all of these different producers. So on this note, I'd like to invite you all to uh, I am DDB to December in the AB. I know you think it's sold out, but it's not. We got an earlier show for everybody who didn't get to have tickets. <laughs> we didn't get to have tickets. <laughs> so if you want to be informed about my future shows, catch your Samu on Facebook, Blue Samu. Pew, pew.